Hey y'all, Faith Barrett's here, your favorite Hollywood actress. I know, God makes miracles. Anyway, it's Saturday fun day and I am doing auditions at home. And I just wasted an hour of my time with a company called JPR, um, John Robert Powers or something like that, okay? They told me they wanted to audition for me. They can get you in front of agents and managers and things like that. Turns out the company's a big scam, okay? They want you to pay them to go to Hollywood school and then put you in front of agents and managers if they even put you in front of agents and managers. It's like they charge something ridiculous like $3,000 to like prep you and then call agents and managers and be like, I have a person for you to look at, okay? If they even do, okay? They probably don't. It's probably all just a big scam, okay? So that's the point of this video is to watch out for scams, y'all. There's companies like John Robert Powers, John Casablanca's, things like that, that sell you an acting school or sell you a modeling school. The only thing you need to pay for if you want to become an actor or an actress or a model in the entertainment industry is you need headshots, okay? But you can get those for free. You can do trade with photographers when you're just starting out. The only other thing you should pay for is acting classes where you focus on the technique of acting, okay? You can go to like um, a Juilliard or, you know, an art school. An art school is like the best, especially an art school that has showcases um, that will put you in front of agents and managers, okay? So if you want to go to an art school, then do that. Like a lot of people make it big that go to Juilliard, okay? I didn't have the, uh, I didn't have that luxury of going to one of those schools. I never did. Okay. I wish I had when I was younger. Anyway, also to be successful in this industry, it really sucks, but you really need, <laughs> it's harder if you're older and my age. Okay. If you're young and pretty, it's easier, but don't get sucked into these scam artists selling you a modeling school like John Casablanca or whatever. You don't need to pay them, okay? There's so many things you can do if you wanna be an actress or a model. You can go on to LA Casting, sign up with them. Go on Actors Access, sign up with them. You can go on Backstage, sign up with them. Okay, there's like, okay, you can go on Backstage and join for a month. I think it's $20. You can download something that's called the Call Sheet. The Call Sheet, they update every single year with agency information and they tell you how to submit to agents. It's really easy to get a commercial agent. Anybody can get a commercial agent because that's where the money's at, okay? Anybody can get a commercial agent. So spend $20, go on backstage, download the call sheet, cancel your membership. You paid $20 for the call sheet with all the updated info about the agencies. Go there, email them. I'm gonna have to do that myself because my manager gets me a lot of auditions, but my agent, like I'm not happy with because it's like, if you piss off one person in this industry, they will blacklist you. If you don't do one audition, they will not submit you anymore. And you don't even know if your agent's actually submitting you, okay? It's like, I work 24 seven, okay? If I don't wanna do a self tape because I'm exhausted and need to sleep, and my agent is gonna get pissed off that I didn't do that, well then you know what? There's no more in-person auditions anymore. Everything self-tapes. Okay, I have to work to pay my bills. Sorry, I'm not a sugar hooker. Sorry, I'm not a gold digger. Sorry, I'm not a trust fund kid. Sorry, I have to, I have to work 24 seven to pay my bills. Sorry if I can't do every flipping self-tape for you, okay? Sorry, okay? So it's really tough. And if you piss off one casting agency, by not showing up for, up for a job or canceling a job because you booked something better, they will blacklist you. And blacklisting is illegal in California. And there's companies, Idell James is the worst. Idell James, do not use Idell James. Do not use Central Casting. Central Casting and Idell James, they're the worst. They will blacklist you. They will black, they are evil. Evil, 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 okay? So don't, don't pay for anything, okay? Don't pay these people to take you to an acting school to learn how to do your hair and stand up. No, all you need to do is get on IMDb Pro, 
Okay, IMDB Pro, that costs money though too. So your best bet is to download the call sheet at backstage.com for $20 and cancel a membership, get some pictures, selfies. Selfies are fine for commercial agents. That's all you need to know. You don't need to pay any outrageous people like scam artists. Okay, these people are scam artists just trying to take your money. You don't need to spend your money like to become an, you don't need to pay agents. You don't need to pay modeling schools. You don't need to go to school to be a model. Okay, just get some photographers, like take some pictures and post it. Like you don't need to, John, I just wasted an hour of my time with these people who are then gonna start charging families. They're selling a dream. I pray that these people don't burn in hell because they are selling a fantasy to people. They make you think, oh, you're gonna be famous. All it costs is $3,000. No, there's another guy out there who is the um, the actual son of a big producer trying to scam me and my friends by saying, oh, let, we're going to read your script and we're going to put it in, in front of the board. The board's going to read it. And then the board of directors decides if they want to green light it. Okay. And if they want to green light it, we're going to take it to John Peters. Okay. Yeah. Chris Peters, his son was doing this. So... Uh, if we like your script, we're going to take it to my dad and my dad's going to shop it around. Okay. But first you have to pay me $5,000. I'm sorry. What? I don't flip and think so. And they, and he scammed a lot of people. I know a lot of people that paid a lot of money. My friend was going to pay them money. I'm like, are you flipping nuts? Let's meet with this guy, set him up and get everybody that he scammed to like beat the crap out of him. Okay. Cause I know people that he's took like $15,000 from and did nothing. Okay, so you will get scammed in this industry. Go watch Baby Reindeer. <laughs> Go watch Baby Reindeer. Baby Reindeer is a true story, okay, about a really bad comedian who wanted to be famous so bad. He believed this guy was a writer. We don't know if he really was a writer or if he's a fake writer. He's probably not even a writer. He's probably just pretending he was the writer of these famous shows and invited this guy over to his house and um, was telling him, oh, I'm going to make you famous. You can make it. You can work for me. You know, you can create shows. I'll put you in shows. And then he drugged him and raped him, okay, and sent him on his way and asked him to do rewrites and some a bunch of BS. And the guy, the kid um, in the show, kept going back because he kept believing that this guy was going to make him famous. So he kept doing drugs, kept getting raped over and over and over again because this guy was selling him on a dream. Take the rose colored glasses off people, okay? Just pe so many people get scammed in this industry. Like you don't need to pay anybody any money, okay? Your agents, which is the industry standard now, will take 10% out of your paycheck, which is BS, man. They already get 20% on top of your pay and then they wanna take another 10 from you. There's other... There, I work for a company called Commercial Extras, and it's like pretty much like you pay a one-time processing fee, okay, whatever, $40, that's fine. But then you sign up to do work with them, they take 10% from you. They take 10% from you. It's like, is that legal? I don't know. Agencies take 10 I don't know if it's legal, but like I've booked a few good jobs from them, and I've gotten paid decent Pay, so it's like, I don't mind. Okay, I'm gonna send you $30, that's fine. You know, whatever. Because there's so many evil people in this industry that will blacklist you. Like, they don't wanna pay you. If you piss them off, they will blacklist you. This industry is so, okay. So don't pay Jonathan Robert Powers. Don't pay John Casablancas. Don't believe the hype, y'all. Don't believe their BS. Don't take out your wall and don't pay them. There's things you can do for free. If anybody has any questions, in the entertainment industry, I've I've been through it all. I have a lot of experience. Y'all can leave me a comment. Let me know if there's anything you want to know about it. I can try to help you, but don't pay these people. They're selling you on a fantasy and you'll keep writing them checks. You'll mortgage the house and writing them checks for what? For nothing. You don't need to do that. Anybody can get a commercial agent. Anybody can go on LA Castings. Casting Networks is the best. Whatever city you're in, Casting Networks, start there. Okay, even Craigslist, but Craigslist, you have to be careful because there's a lot of creepos out there. So you have to be smart, okay? So that's all I wanted to talk about today. I wasted an hour of my time with these stupid people. I left the meeting and I was like, no, thank you. So, but at least I'm camera ready because I have actual legitimate auditions to do.
today for real that I got an actor's access in LA castings. Like, so that's what I'm gonna do today. I only have time on the weekends to do auditions because during the week I'm too busy. I'm dog walking from nine in the morning till eight o'clock at night. And then um, on the days I get booked things, I can take off from the dog walking and go to set for my acting gig. So that's what I do. So I barely have time to do self tapes and auditions. So um, the weekends is when I have time to do them. So I have zero time to myself. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm gonna go do some more auditions. Don't get scammed by these evil people out there that are gonna burn in hell for selling you on a dream. And don't believe people if they tell, there's so much evil in this industry, they will use you, take advantage of you. Look at all the scams that's going on with the sex trafficking and all this stuff. It's so bad, okay? <laughs> yeah, have a blessed day, y'all.